Okay, you got all this music and you feel like you just ain't took it serious. Sometimes it be too much. You kind of like quiet though. Like I'm looking now, I'm interviewed. This is my first time really talking to you. You like extra laid back. Really? You know what I'm saying? And part of it is now you really got to be like out there, like with your personality. Yeah, yeah you think that's it too? No, uh, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm I mean, gonna, I ain't gonna lie. I, I'm the type of person like, like I ain't gonna say. Like if I ain't, I'm not that hyped up here. Like it's a life for everybody though. Yeah, you know, but I ain't. I ain't. I'm, I'm just gonna be me. I'm saying. I I just gotta be me. Yeah. If people don't fuck with me, they don't fuck with me. They don't. Yeah. How long you think? Okay, let's say a rapper you coming in the game, young rapper. How long do you think is like? I guess your time frame to where uh, you really got to start like kicking up dust before you can really say like, damn, this shit ain't working. Shit. This ain't about you. Though. This for other people. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to get your opinion. Yeah. You like talking about like age range or something? Not even age range, but let's say you come in in 2015. Mm -hmm. How long before you feel like, when I say you start getting traction to what people fucking with you? If they ain't fucking with you and it's about a time, it ain't gonna work. Shit, can't really say that. You at least gotta get your city though. Or at least your, your area. Shit, Travis Scott didn't get his city first. Well, that's true. But you got the world first, though. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can't really just say this shit can be not working. You got in 2015, she didn't pop off for you until 2020. You, you, you drop something and go crazy. Right. People fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? So it ain't even, you can't even look at it like that. You really just gotta just work. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you, you playing the patience game. Yeah. Listen. Hey, look, I made an interview. I'm calling you right back. You know, it's just really just by working. You can't even just. Once you start, I mean, shit. <laughs> once you start getting that old gray hair and you know it's over <laughs> with, man, hang that shit up, bro. Uh, you know what I'm saying? But this shit can pop any day, right? Like. Yeah. But you, you gotta have at least something by the time you get gray. You know what I'm saying? You really oh yeah, you gotta uh, cause this shit working. I, one thing I learned from doing interviews and just peeping the shit more closely than I would before is that this shit work for somebody, some people, and it just don't work for some other people. Like it's like a, a favoritism. Pick people pick and choose. Like some shit might nigga might have the best music, but it's just if you ain't got that thing that people really. Believe you or something, I don't know what it is. Yeah. You see that though. Yeah, yeah. But it, as it go, I just like, damn, like, if you've been putting in all this work and you ain't really getting no results, it's like, damn, you ain't got nothing else going on. You know what I'm saying? You got to have something else going on yeah. while you're doing the music because that shit counts. Uh, when you feel it, when you first get that shit counts. Motherfucker ain't just giving you free beats or letting you come to the car for free, shooting you free videos. So you gotta have something else going on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You see a lot of a lot of people that's in the way, like taking a space that just don't really got it. You see that around? Man, I ain't gonna lie, like I ain't gonna just say that because shit practice make perfect. So, the nigga might be trash right now, but shit, he might get it. Yeah. He stay at it. You know what I'm saying? So, I can't really just say somebody in the way. It'd be more like shit. Everybody scratching, trying to get the same thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Ultimately, everybody's journey in the music is like different. So, it's like some might take long, some might, you know what I'm saying? But from, from everything you said, I take from you that you're going for that like longevity game. You're not really looking for that pop to blow. Like, you're really trying to take it the long run. It seems like. 
Nah, I ain't gonna say that. Okay, shit. I ain't gonna say that. So you are looking for that hit? I mean, shit, if I, I put it out, I ain't gonna say I'm just, just kind of looking for it. It's just shit, I just do it and put it out. Like, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, yeah, we live, you know, so if it, it pop, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just really do it and put it out, though. But I, be, I know I make good music, though. You make great music. Sure. Man, yeah. man, if you if you start rap beefing, your shit'll go up. That look like the cheat code right now. Yeah, but I ain't I ain't into that. Go, I go go. I ain't with that shit. Do you see that though? I mean, you see it not just online. Yeah, I, I see it though. You know, if a new, you know, beefing and shit, then yo, this shit gonna be doing something because it's gonna be a lot of attention around. That. You know, some people gonna be looking to see what he might say or some shit. I ain't, I ain't really trying to do no rap beef though. No. Yeah. So if a nigga came at you on some rap beef and shit, you just ignore it. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> have you been involved? In, like, have you been involved in any type of rap? Well, now here's a better question. I'm gonna let you get back to that question too. But here's a better question. Since you've been rapping in three years. Has anybody even have you encountered any rap beef? Like just coming up on your way trying to trying to you know? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 How you handle it though? Man, I ain't gonna lie, that shit. That shit was lame, I ain't gonna lie. How did it happen? When was this? How did it happen? It wasn't really just nothing that like. It wasn't just nothing to like. It was, it was basically more like, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, me and my people, shit, we was on some lame shit. But it wasn't nothing serious, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, it wasn't nothing that serious. But the rap beef and shit, like, that shit get me. That shit gonna get somebody killed. <laughs> I mean, it had. I ain't, I ain't into just rap beefing. But I ain't to be rap beefing with you. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we really got a problem with each other. We gonna bump into each other. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? One thing I noticed about, like, a lot of Houston artists is that, like, man, Houston, it be so much shit going on in the city. But Houston artists, like, more than a lot of other cities, they always be, like, cautious about bringing the beef to the forefront. Yeah. Like, with other cities, they love to, like, like Fort Worth, Dallas, they Chicago. Yeah. That's they make they they bread and butter off of that shit. Yeah. Man, you think so? You agree? I mean, yeah. I, I guess I ain't gonna lie. Them niggas do do a lot of rap beef. Yeah. Okay. But I, I don't know. I, I think you know some of niggas. That shit. I wouldn't just say. Just, I ain't gonna just say do a lot of rap beef. Like you niggas know, be having some beef going on. Right. That. Right. Rappers, you know what I'm saying? Right, let me say it, cause I don't want to say yeah. it like they just clout chasing. Yeah, them niggas probably got real issues. Real issues and shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's just like. But they let it get to the forefront, you yeah. know what I'm saying? I, I just feel like, I just feel like, you, like once it's, once it's like, once it's publicized and all that shit like that, like. It ain't, it ain't no use to really entertain. Y'all got real beef. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? This is gonna go down. It'll be true. Yeah. It'll be rap beef and the internet beef and then like be beefing in real life. Like, I'm trying to do all that. Because me personally, if I'm gonna do something, I'm trying to do it and get away with it. Right. Right, right, right. I ain't trying to do it and let everybody know I did something. You know what I'm saying? The cloud chasing be getting so heavy sometimes it's hard to tell the real from the fake. Like what's real beef and what's real you know what I'm saying? A lot of people got it confused. Yeah. Uh -huh.